Hi coders, looks like you really like my Star Wars series, so let's make another one. Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of my CSS animation tutorial series where we explore what can be done with modern CSS3 techniques. Today, we will practice using keyframes animation, transform rotate, transform translate x, before pseudo element and more. Make sure you subscribe and click the bell icon so you don't miss my future videos. I've been building loads of CSS effects lately, more animations are coming soon. Also like the video if you like this type of content, I watch likes, dislikes and comments closely when deciding what to do for the next tutorial. Your feedback is important. We are building CSS only loader animations styled as BB-8 Droid from the new Star Wars trilogy. This will be a quick one. Get your coding socks on and let's start. In index.html I link style CSS file and create div with a class of loader. Inside we have two sibling div elements, one with a class of droid and other with a class of text. Div with a class of text will contain a single span element with text that says loading in capital letters. You can get the HTML markup to draw the droid in video description or if you are here to learn, you can watch my previous video where we build it line by line. I also discuss drawing characters and objects with pure CSS in more detail and I explain CSS variables in that video. So I copy the code from the previous tutorial to create the div with a class of droid. Let's remove the outer div as now we have to. In style CSS we declare basic reset rules to avoid any cross-browser inconsistencies. Star selector will target all elements and set margin and padding to zero, box size into border box. Loader div will contain all our elements. I want it exactly in the middle of the screen so I use the usual absolute positioning trick, position absolute. Top 50%, left 50%, transform translate minus 50%, minus 50%. For this to work, you need to give element width and height, so let's do 140 times 140 pixels. Diff with a class of text will be positioned absolutely minus 30 pixels from the bottom margin of its parent element and centered horizontally with left 50%, transform translate minus 50% zero. Overflow will be hidden, body left and body right 1 pixel solid black. By default, span is an inline element. By setting its display property to inline block, it will accept width and height properties. I give it custom animation I call move left. I will create it in a minute. It will repeat itself every 1.5 seconds infinitely and I give it linear time in, which means every part of the animation is running the same speed. Font size will be 30 pixels. Then I create a before pseudo element and set its mandatory content property to text that says loading with capital letters. I'm basically creating another virtual element identical to spawn element, so let's give it the same styles. Display inline block, width 140 pixels, height 30 pixels. I position it absolutely 110% from the left edge of its parent, top zero. Let me quickly remove overflow hidden so you can see what's happening behind the scenes. Now I just import styles for the droid I built in the previous video. Few things need to be tweaked. On the div with a class of droid, I add position top 0, remove bottom and set left to 0. I add border 1 pixel solid black to the head div. Same with the div with a class of body. I add border 1 pixel solid black. Something has gone terribly wrong with BB8's eyes. Let's quickly fix it. Eyes container will be positioned 36% from the left edge. Remove eyes right declaration. Not needed here. Eye 1 height and width will be 30 pixels. I2 after height and width will be 10 pixels. Radius left 0 and the remove radius right declaration not needed for this animation. Also remove border from the loader div. I will add animation I call wobble to the entire droid div. It will repeat itself every 5 seconds infinitely and timing function will be ease in out, which means it will start and end slowly, 
and move faster in the middle, which makes it more realistic. Things in the real world rarely move the same speed all the time. I give the animation 3 breakpoints, 0, 50 and 100%. It will go from transform rotate 0 to transform rotate 10 degrees and back to 0. I will also add animation to the droid's body element. I will call it roll. It will repeat itself infinitely every 5.2 seconds. We will declare steps for our animation with keyframes. We want the body to rotate. I will go from transform rotate 0 to transform rotate 360 degrees. Nice. We also want the text to move. I call that animation move left. It will go from transform translate x 0 to transform translate x minus 110 degrees. Like this. By making it infinite and giving it no time to animate back, it will just snap back to its starting position, which will create illusion of continuous movement. Similar technique can be also used for endless image sliders. Now that you can see what's happening in the background, I can reapply overflow hidden to the text diff. I have many more creative coding tutorials on the channel, some Star Wars themed web design effects, CSS effects playlist, and vanilla javascript and html canvas animation series check it out thank you very much for watching more videos coming soon see you next time